end. <laughs> My grandmother was many things. Intelligent, talented, persevering, mischievous, witty, barely scratches the surface. But intelligence, wit, or talent alone don't leave this kind of legacy. It doesn't fill <coughs> this room, and it doesn't give us all of these stories that we're sharing. I believe that what made Anna Henderson a great woman, what made her so influential and memorable to all of us, was her love. Um, and I mean a kind of love that I've never witnessed in any other person. She wasted none of her time getting hung up on people's faults. Uh, whether by nature or by choice, our flaws and failures weren't important to her. Now, she wasn't blind to anything. Um, and when she decided something needed addressing, she talked directly to you about it. Uh, she didn't expect anyone to read her mind, and she sure wasn't going to fret over trying to read your mind. But she didn't let anyone's shortcomings get in the way of her loving them. And for me, this is both the most wonderful and the most challenging part of her legacy. As much as I love the parts of myself that I see coming from her. The way that she was patient or gentle or generous to a fault. That is harder to grapple with. I aspire to be like her in that regard. To see everyone fully, warts and all, and decide over and over and over again that whatever their faults may be, that loving them is more important. I'd like to finish with reading um, Paragraph <coughs> on Immortality by Henry Van Dyke. I'm standing upon the seashore. A ship at my side spreads her white sails to the morning breeze and starts for the blue ocean. She's an object of beauty and strength. I stand and watch until at last she hangs like a speck of white cloud just where the sea and the sky come down to mingle with each other. And someone at my side says, there she goes. Gone where? Gone from my sight, that is all. She is just as grand and vast and hull and spar as she was when she left my side. Her diminished stock size is in me. Not in her. And just at the moment when someone in my side says, There she goes, there are other eyes watching and coming, and other voices ready to take up the glad shout, Here she comes. Thank you.